Davis, you're dead right. As good as anybody's. Well said. He's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. I think he's left a combination. Slightly hampered here, he'll be bending the cue ball. Yeah, with, the, uh, with his skill at the swerve, you'd say it was all done, you'd get it. That's it. Well, they were applauding the combination and the fact that the other ball went. Oh, baby, I got lucky. <laughs> Kamusta mga kaibigan? Isa na namang mabagsik na laban ni Efren. Ang babalikan natin, ang laban niya kontra sa isang snooker legend. Ito ang WPL na ginanap sa Warsaw, Poland. Halos wala talagang kapaguran itong si Efren noong araw. Dahil pagkatapos manalo ni Efren sa Japan ng 150,000 ay isang linggo lamang ay dumayo naman siya sa Poland para kumilimbat ng dolyares para sa 15,000 dollar na pocket money niya pa uwi ng Pilipinas. Parang lapit eh no? Biruin nyo, yung Japan at Poland e eh parang ginawa lang niyang probinsya dito sa Pinas. Anyway, hindi din biro ang kalaban ni Efren dito mga kaibigan. Dahil kahit napakataas magtake ng damit ni Steve Davis, e eh hindi dapat maliti ng person. Si Steve Davis ay isa lang naman sa pinakamatatag na legend sa kasaysayan ng snooker. Ngayon e eh balik tanawin natin ang sagupaan ng dalawang dambuhala sa lamesa. Aabangan natin dito ang mga kamanghamanghang safety place ng The Magician at ang sagutan ng dalawang legends. Absolutely riveting Andy Richardson who's illuminated our commentary with his insight. Unang sumargo si Efren dito sa first rack. Walang pumasok. Pagod pa ata siya galing Japan. You would expect Reyes's experience at one level to be a dominant factor. But you have to set against the fact that like Buster Monday. Well said, I think he played that. Tried the one nine. Dropped away the codex of Holland. The world champion. Mika Eminen went out to Davis. Ball in hand. At dito nga ay na budget si Idol Davis. Kaya ball in hand si Efren. Literally at pace. Had a chance of making it in the corner and if not. Wanted to leave distance between the balls. Didn't manage to make contact. This tournament's on everything. Efren here had his hair and Elvis style for a while. Was singing Andy up with the best chicken and rice we've ever had. There's been brilliant play. There's been golden breaks. Now. Sa tournament na ito ay maguwi ng fifteen thousand dollars ang magte champion. Our voices lasting out. Despite giving the tonsils a battering, trying to keep tabs on these brilliant players. Reyes finished tickle. Looks to work down table for the brown seven. Playing this with right hand side, Sid. Lots of side to run across to the side rail. Yeah, prime position on the seven ball. He'll be stunning out off the rail. Leaving himself an easy eight. Looking good for one zero. And again, the stone shot with the right hand side, making this. At nakuha ni Efren ang unang rap. The first time a man revered in the Philippines, Davis, into the pack. Sa second break ay ginamit ni Davis ang ultimate high tack in break niya. Napakalakas. Wow. Red 3. Is the gimme? Pink 4. Good chance for Steve this. No. Davis is first major final. In world pool, he has gained 
Ang tangka din pala talaga nito ni Daddy Longlegs Davis. Diretso tayo sa 7 track. 4-2 ang score. He's well back in the game. A slaughterhouse of a break. Oh, eat your heart out, Kurt Bunnigut. Sa sargo ni Efren ay nakahulog siya ng apat na bola. Mukhang nawala na ang jet lag ni Idol. When they said playing the left hand side of midfield, and he played on the right hand side. He's played the safety. Dito ang safety play ni Efren sa dos. I think he's left him sight of this two ball. To mind comes quickly the, uh, the epic battle at Cardiff in the middle of. Sinagot naman ng safety play ni Davis. Davis was eight two down. Oh no wonder. Dito ay sumablay si Efren, kaya naiwan ng open table kay Davis. Looking good then for 4-3. Into the cush again. Using run inside that time. Perfect on the nine ball. He's coming back. So 4-3. Game on in one. The clatter in action. Particularly at break time. Ikawalong rack. Walang naihulog si Davies. Well... Four three, Reyes leads. Trying to clip this rightward and get position on the blue two. Two rails. Sa larong ito mga kaibigan ay 47 years old si Efren, at sa panahon na ito ay talagang kinakatakutan na si Efren sa buong mundo. Till get to the nine that is. Yep, just holds the three. Six as well. Lalo na't kaka-champion lang niya sa Japan Open bago ang larong ito. To be the other side of the nine, really, I think. Yes, he did definitely. A wry smile there. He's chuckling. Oh, you don't get to be the boss magician. Well, you had better look. Simple. Making it look simple. Five three. Steve Davis. Nine track. Dito ay nakita natin ang safety play ni Efren at ang cue ball control niya. Maybe not, maybe not Sid, but uh, still made balls. The question is, does the one pass? Well now. They're like a gargoyle. Who's that? So, may not take the attacking option. That's right, Sid. Deliver it. Yes, he was certainly playing safe there. Sending the ball. Maybe a slightly better result than he intended, but... in the jaw fortunate there is difficult 
but from that angle you see he's got half the ball away Matt could have done without that though Efren extreme check side on the cue ball to bring himself back for the two in the same pocket Ang torneo na ito ay nilahukan din ni Jiang Gubustamante na nag-uwi naman ng 7,500 bilang third place. With rubber gloves on, it's so so. It's not as a world sport meeting here, I guess. A unique combination. Look, coming from the discipline of snooker. <laughs> so we could look. It was one of the greatest that ever played pool. And to see the mutual respect and the crowd's awareness of it. And he's he was continuing the comeback. Top draw clearance. This great four ball. Use the full size of the pocket with the orange five. Under extreme pressure. Pegs back to 5-4. Ten track. Isa na namang tack in break ang ginawa ni Daddy Long Legs Davis. His own break. A tremendous break there. Pity that the blue run on. Yeah, was he there? Bustamante was the one who sorted it out first. I think he set the pace. They do watch each other. But Davis, you're dead right. Greg has been as good as anybody's. Safety shot. At dito, nag safety shot si Daddy Long Leg Davis. He's unfortunate there. Very unfortunate. I think he's left a combination. He knows it. Slightly hampered here. He'll be bending the cue ball. Yeah, but the, uh, with his skill at the swerve, you'd say it was all done, you'll get it. That's it. Well, Magic shot ni Efren, kaso walang posisyon para sa 4. Hindi dapat niya ipapasok yung dos eh. Efren would have preferred that too to stay up. He's left himself something to do with this pink four now. Dressing it, apparently with left hand. Left hand side. Looking lovely on the orange, but like you said, that was it. To level the match. At 5-5, this would be anybody's. In July 2000, when Davis was 8-2 down to root a 9-8 win. Game, five apiece. Nakuha ni Davis ang 10 track. 11 track. Sargo ni Efren from Japan. Efren really hit those balls there. He's a shot on the one ball. In the corner pocket. Across the far side of the table for the red three next. Superb shot. Yep, superb draw. This rack. Si Davis pala mga kaibigan ay nagtaya din ng maraming kampiyonato sa snooker. Ang huling na italang panalo nga niya bilang professional ay ang Seniors Irish Masters noong 2018. Perfect position. So he's got that white on a piece of string. Oh, the sort of money Efren Max on a piece of gold thread. Straight forward eight ball into the middle. But tap in this. Tap in the nine. Stand for six five. To the magician. At nakuha ni Efren ang eleven track. This final Efren Reyes had twelve rack. Snookhead. Now Davis. Bottom rail. Isang combination ang pinakita ni Efren dito sa bay ng safety shot. Well, bonus. Didn't intend the three ball, but he'll take it. It'll be ominous for Davis. Yeah. 
for saying the more I practice, the more lucky I get. I think it's fair to say, is that said? Very delicate shot he's played. It's difficult for Steve now. Cool final. Race to nine. Trails at the moment. Well, then Riaz could well step in here. The run. Yeah, not straightforward for him though. Consequently, overcut the ball. And he's left Steve a good chance here. Sure has. Two into the corner pocket, he'll be playing. Orange five. To come back down for the green six at the bottom of the table. Beautifully weighted. He's going to be happy, I think. Nah. Well, it was so straight that he had to draw. He had to do... Well, no, no. Long. Tremendous pot there. Very, very difficult pot. And also position has got to be got by topping it through. Yeah, we had to play that, Sid. That was a shot to nothing, in effect. We say that, but we know what Efren's like. Look at the back Knowledgeable shot. crowd, yeah, appreciating. Davis's attempt. Will the maestro plant this long, we reckon, bottom right? Bank shot from Japan. Bottom left. Anywhere he likes. Well, we couldn't quite see exactly how he was. had a rough idea of how long he was prepared to take that bank shot. This for 7 5. And this is a 13 trap. Sargun Efren. Kaso nag scratch. Kaya bolin Hansi Davis. 7 5. Reyes needs to... really needs this rack. If he can take this rack, he has the break in the next. Just needs to land shot. Extreme. Bottom spin on it. Bottom right hand side to increase the angle. But slightly hampered by the green six here. But he st should still make this ball. Pink. Maybe looking at two rails here. He may be running through it. Yep, two rails he's tried. Well, extreme draw. He was prepared to move that ball nine feet. Backwards, just watch where he was prepared to take the whites. And in that part of consideration, forgot about the pot. Yep, deli Now to get onto the six. Hampered by the jaws of the middle pocket as well. What if he gets it? He's looking to bring it off that cush and that one about perfect angle. Grabe talaga ang mga position play nila mga kaibigan. Just where he wanted it. Rack over. Bottom rail with left hand side here. Bottom and side. A matter of inches. Ball. Stone dead to me from the Whirlpool League title. 8-5! Reyes! Good win! Napasimangot doon si Daddy Long Leg Davis. First ever stick. 14 track. Isa na lang at panalo na ang The Magician. Oh, seven!
Savage, nasty, cruel game. Productive break. He likes the push. Pushing across the table. Dito ay nagpush si Daddy Long Legs. Trying to leave an edge of this two ball. Just attempt. Just attempt. Shot on here. Three around the brown. <laughs> yes, Sid. And did you really mean a bank here? Look at that for accuracy. At pinili ni Efren to mira ng safety play. And look at that for the... Playing the edge of this two. He needs to get safe. So, and so what is answer to had a dragon, Steve Davis. Trying might and main to keep this man at bay. Remember, everyone takes this rack, he's the champ. Grabbing safety play, mga kaibigan. Napangiti pati referee sa kanya. Iba talaga ang pagkakyut ni Master Efren, pati referee na papangiti. So, if indeed it ends soon, that Steve Davis is engaged in a battle of snooker with Reyes. Well, Sid. And Steve. Beautiful. 90 degree draw. Three into the middle. Side, bottom, side cushion again. Back out for the long four. Sid. You don't need to be Mick Jagger to know the way down Route 66. And this particular route, nowhere near. As soon as the magician waves his wand, and I'm telling you, when he struts his stuff, eight ball into the same pocket. Effectively, title ball that. Look, fan, too much. At dito nga ay natalo ni Efren si Daddy Longlegs Davis at siya ang nagchampion sa WPL 2002.